It's Wednesday and Tegan's admiring himself in the mirror. It didn't break, you just pulled the drawer out. You can put it back in. There you go. And look who's here. Me. Our house is haunted, guys. We the have a ghost of a toddler. <laughs> this is a pint size ghost. <laughs> it is. Oh, Whoa. crazy kiddo. I see and we, and, we, and we're getting it, and we're getting it on camera. There's not many people can get footage of ghosts. <laughs> Ooh, are we gonna be ghost hunters now? Yeah. New channel, John and Min ghost hunting. There we go. You heard it here first, people. <laughs> Come on, we're gonna go get some. We're gonna go get something to eat. So we're on our way to get some lunch. Jenna's in the back seat. Jenna, can you wave? There she is. <laughs> They kidnapped me. And there's Ben and Tegan's back there too. But before we go get some lunch, we're doing a drive-by of the movie theater because rumor has it that they're going to be opening up pretty soon. <laughs> tonight? The, the rumor was today. It might be tonight. I think they're doing some um, like test runs. So I don't think we'll be going, but we're gonna we're gonna peek in and see what's going on. Are you excited, Jenna? Woo! <laughs> well, I noticed we had a different sign when I was driving in. Yeah, they got this temporary banner for Flagship Cinemas Premium. Oh, they took down the lettering that said... Yeah. They took down the lettering on the sign that said, Under Renovations Opening Soon. Oh, the Icy Man is out front. I'm just gonna drive through like I own the place. Yep. And it'll look like crazy people holding a camera. Because that that's what we do. <laughs> we look crazy just for you. Okay, let's drive by really slow so we can. Cleaner. Than... Oh, there's a theater door open right there. Sorry, you're, you need I to roll down your window. Your reflection is. There's signs. Oh, they do say showings tonight on the door. Oh, yeah, look at that. There are going to be shows tonight. OMG, Ben, are we going to go to the movies? Who's going to watch Tegan? Grimmy, Jenna? Oh. Jenna? <laughs> okay, this is just mean. You, you conned me into coming out to move your washer and dryer, and now I'm gonna watch Tegan while you guys go to the movies? Yeah, sounds like, sounds fair. We're buying you lunch. <laughs> I see how you people are. I see how you roll. <laughs> So just as a time capsule, I have here on the phone the movie listings for the first night of the newly reopened flagship cinemas. I really doubt we'll be going tonight, but just for the record, what's going on back there? So what's showing on Wednesday, August 24th, 2016, the very first showing at the newly reopened flagship cinemas is going to be Jason Bourne at 6.40 p.m. tonight. Isn't that exciting? Yeah. Pete's Dragon follows that up at 6.55. Oh, actually, technically War Dogs is at 6.50, but I'll just run them down real quick because years from now we'll be going, like, wow, I remember that in the theater. So we got Bad Moms at 7.15, Jason Bourne at 6.40, Pete's Dragon at 6.55. I'm kind of curious to see the re redone Pete's Dragon, aren't you? Yeah, I don't really remember much from the animated Pete's Dragons. Let's see, Sausage Party at 7.20, Secret Life of Pets at 7.10, Suicide Squads at 7 p.m., and War Dogs is at 6.50 p.m. That's pretty exciting. I wonder how much the movies are going to cost now. Let's see, pricing. It still says matinees are only $5.50. I don't know how they're doing it. That's what they were before they closed. No. And now they're... No? Full... Uh, oh, they were four seventy-five. Yeah, yeah. That yeah, that's how crazy low the cinema is. Five fifty. That's that's a bargain. Because full-time movies, they were five. Yeah, either five or five fifty. Yeah. So matinees are five fifty, and evening showings are seven dollars, which, in the scheme of things, are really good prices for movies. It's lower than the one that we would travel to Auburn yes. to go see, and they had horrible seating. They kept the lights on all the time and and everything. So, woohoo! It's closer, and we save money. So, we, so we're in the truck now. We've had some lunch. We've been visiting with Jenna, and now we're gonna bring over our washer and our dryer, and Jenna cannot wait. 
Jenna loves moving. Moving is her middle name. Do you guys look at the weather reports and say, hey, <laughs> it's, it's going to be about 80 degrees today. Let's move today. <laughs> and not only that, the air conditioner in our, in our truck is broken. Jenna's day gets better and better. <laughs> I got suckered. We, we appreciate you coming over though. Oh no, I, I understand that. I think I just got suckered. <laughs> the washing machine is on its way out. So you are coming up, coming up. Your first step is a little one. Okay. All right. All right. Ready for the next, next one? one. You want to move that sprinkler? Okay. Take. Okay. Okay. One more. Yep. One more. All right. One more, and then we're on the ground. Okay. One, two. All right. So now we'll spin. Yeah. Okay. All right, John, get over here and help. I am helping. Oh! Dancing with the washer. I'm going to create a new genre of dance, dancing with appliances. <laughs> All right, so I think you would want this back. And it's in the truck. The washing machine is in the truck, Jenna. I come with a guarantee if the appliances are broken upon arrival, it's not Jenna's fault. I think Jenna has found her true calling. You can be appliance delivery. No, dancing. Mover. No, not mover. No, will you stop saying mover? <laughs> At least I'm in the shade. Je Jenna moving company. No, that's not it either. The dryer should be easy. Er. There's no water. Yeah, there's no water. This thing still has water in it. And it smells like poop. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder how that wasn't how, me either. How do you clean a washer? They have washer cleaner. We should do that because it stinks. They have some at Home Depot. Or yeah, we're gonna have to go to Home Depot or someplace anyway because our drain hose isn't gonna be long enough for our new house. Nope. All right, we're halfway done. Halfway done moving them out, and then we get to move them back into the house. Jenna, Jenna, come back. Jenna. I don't have a vehicle. You people. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> you have to walk home. What's Jenna moving today? It's gonna be a whole thing. Just gonna, you just hold find your side. Find some nice dancing music to it. We're creating a whole new genre of dance. That's a good idea. When we speed up the footage, then we'll look up some dancing music. Like ballroom dancing. Nah. Or like na 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 There's probably something on. Okay, so what's going on? Jenna and I are going to get in the truck and we're going to lift this thing, but you need to guide the back end so it doesn't fall off. Okay. So you need to put the camera down. <laughs> Just like put down the ducky if you want to play the saxophone. <laughs> <laughs> so find a spot, find a happy home for your camera. Let's go. <laughs> you have to leave that part in. All right, we're put it on top of the wood pile there. All right. And here they are, 
half the battle's over with. Now the other. Us or the washer and dryer? I meant the washer and dryer being out into the truck is half the battle. The other half of the battle is bringing them into the new house. But then Ben and I are going to have to go into Home Depot or something and buy some new hoses and drains and stuff. And then Jenna's going to help hook it up for us. <laughs> no, Jenna's going to be at home. Wondering why I did this on my day off. Mia, do you love us? I and, do. And we bought you Chinese food. Mm. It was, some cheap, huh? You get to see your your grandson and you get to see... I mean, you get to see your... I really going to say what I <laughs> <laughs> I mean... Yes, <Wow>, Sonny! <laughs> you get to see right. your favorite nephew. You know, he is older than me, right? <laughs> you get to see your favorite nephew and you got Chinese food and you get, get to be in today's vlog. And I guess I got exercise, right? Yeah. Oh, look, a fly. A squirrel. Squirrel. Okay, these two guys are home now. I still haven't put down the ducky yet. <laughs> Yay, I can't wait. You're talking washers, huh? Yes. Do you, now, washer, do you eat the socks? That's the dryer. That's the dryer? Are yes. You sure? I tell him to stop, and he gobbles them up. Are you sure? Or is it just a myth that is it's you, the washing machine now? By Jove, I've never eaten a sock in my life. I just wash and clean them. I launder the socks. <laughs> Do you know what they put inside of me? It's disgusting. <laughs> she's trying not to laugh. She's trying she's trying to act ashamed. And this embarrassed. Is gold. This is gold. You got Tegan. Now you got John and <laughs> speaking brother of, and sister. Speaking, and sister. speaking of gold, be sure to go into what's Ryan Tryin .com on YouTube and look up Jenna and Ryan's part oh, this is part four of your Niagara Falls trip. Well it was day three. So one, two I don't even know. Yeah, five? Part four. Five's coming up. Five uh, hasn't been edited yet. Oh. But they go to this super cool Niagara Falls Daredevil Museum where about people who like went over the falls, some of them with more luck than others. I only found one that died. There was one poor <laughs> sucker that he did the falls and then he did some stunt in the air uh Astrodome down in Texas and died there. That wasn't the inner tube guy? That wasn't the inner tube no guy. No spoilers, you'll have to go check this out. Check the inner tube guy. Washer and the dryer have made it home. There's going to be another trip to Lowe's or Home Depot in our future because we need some longer hoses to hook these up. But at least they're here. Jenna was a huge help, so huge thanks to her. Right now we're going to go pick up Tegan. And after that, I don't know if we're going to grab the tubes and stuff for these tonight or not. We'll, we'll see, I guess. It's almost 5 o'clock now, so I have no idea. But man, it is hot outside. Glad these are home.